hi guys welcome back to my channel and today's video I'm really excited about because I it took a while but I'm going to share with you guys some really um, Instagram worthy places here in LA I've lived in LA for pretty much a long time now since I was like in second grade we moved to LA so I've been here quite a while and I've seen a bunch of pictures on Instagram using a lot of the backgrounds that I'm about to share with you guys. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already and like the video just so we can share it. I'm really excited that we've hit 100 subscribers. So thank you guys for all of you guys that are subscribed and let's just get started. So the first place I want to share with you guys is the Venice Canals which I think are called the Caro Canals or something like that. And this place was really nice. It was really empty. Not that many people are there. It's not too crowded. And I went there to actually record my my summer lookbook and record an outfit there. You can go with your friends or with your boyfriend or girlfriend and take pictures. Here we I took pictures with my boyfriend. And it was you just place a camera on top of like the 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 rail thing and you can take pictures on your own. So the next few places are actually all located around the same area except for the Bates Motel which um, it's a little bit far away and I'll probably put in a, a map somewhere to show you guys how close they are to each other. Most of the walls there are very artistic and some restaurants there are very nice as well. Earth Cafe, um, the Pink Wall, the Made in LA, the Butterfly, all these walls are around the same area. So in case you go to that area or you come to visit LA or anything, it's kind of close by so it's just a few minutes driving around. So I would suggest starting off with Earth Cafe. They have great food and a lot of people take pictures of their food so that's one. After that you can move on to the Butterfly Wall which is just like a block away from the Earth Cafe. So it's actually a parking lot. A lot of these are parking lots and it's just the buildings that have like all these artistic walls. If you walk down Melrose, you'll find the pink wall. Most of the walls were empty when I when I went um, and then except the pink wall was a little bit more popular. And then a few more blocks down, you'll find the Made in LA wall. People haven't didn't tell us anything for taking pictures there. So don't worry about that. So if you drive a few blocks away from Melrose Street, you'll find the Angel Wings. So the Bates Motel is a little bit further away from these, these other walls, but it was pretty cool, but at the same time kind of creepy, the building I mean, I've seen the Bates Motel show, so I don't know, if maybe that's why I thought it was kind of creepy, but I mean, it's all painted white and it's like, I don't know, it, it was kind of creepy, but the picture looks cool. So this is the next wall that I went and took a picture. It was very random in a random place, but I mean, I just quickly take, take the picture and you can move on. Of course, you can go to the Grove and you can take a bunch of pictures at the Grove anywhere and in the restaurants, at the fountain, the movies, like the stores, it's just everywhere. It's kind of like a spot for you to take a picture on. Next is LACMA and this one also would be great at night or during the day. I mean, the pictures look great either way because of the lights. So you can always go with your friends or anyone basically. And then behind the lights, you could also take pictures. I mean, it's an open area. There's this rock that looks pretty cool and people were taking pictures like holding it, like supposedly. So you can just go and explore and take pictures. So these next few walls are all near each other as well. So I'm trying to make this easy for you guys so you guys don't have to be driving around like crazy. So the first wall we went to was a polka dot wall which I thought we weren't going to find because we went on the street like the address that I put and then I didn't see it but then we somehow went around and there it was. It's also a parking lot and I didn't know if we were going to be told something because I don't know if they allowed us to be in there. But the next walls are actually right next to each other. They're like 
yellow black and i actually went because i thought it was going to be like a darker blue but i guess they changed the color into a more teal blue and then around the corner you have a red wall this next abstract wall is in downtown so traffic is a little bad and then also parking is a little tougher to find but then there's two abstract walls you can just choose whichever one you like i just chose this one and i just took a picture Next, this shape wall is actually like a small little market in like an isolated part. Um, you have to be careful just because the, the streets here are very steep. They go really high and they go really low. So just be careful. We weren't expecting that and then we kind of got lost in a way. Next, you have the heart mural, which is also... Um, a cool wall it just has a bunch of hearts so you can always take a bunch of your friends and take pictures there you guys would off it it was just really hot this day and I was burning so I didn't record this next place but it's the last bookstore it's really cool it's, except that I felt kind of weird just recording people were like reading and stuff so I didn't want to interrupt them so finally you have California Donuts which their donuts are so like famous and they're all over Instagram and YouTube and the, you actually have to make line outside it's a very small store and you just make line and get your donuts and that's pretty much it I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time bye